Hello, I'm Max Gomez, an augmented reality creator based in Metz in France. Today, I will show you how to use Avatern and how to export your 3D model for making an AI experience for your social network. Let me show you a creation process. First, you have to go to Avatern website, create a new avatar, and the QR code will appear. You will have to scan it with your phone. Then, thanks to three simple pictures, Avatern will create your 3D avatar, validate your photos, and go back to the website. It will load very quickly, and then you can start the customization. Start by choosing your body, your hair, a outfit, and accessories. You can change all the colors. Once it's done, you can validate. The solution are still being in beta test, so to export your avatar, you will have to pass by the Discord server to obtain a notarization. Come back to the website and simply click on export. Then we will animate our digital clone on Mixamo, but we need the model to be in FBX. For the moment, it is still in GLB. We will convert it very simply by opening it in Blender and saving it as an FBX. Once done, we import it in Mixamo and we can choose the animation we want. Take this dance for example. We export it with the skin. Now we can open Spark AR, the AR software from Meta. We will use this simple template here to make it easier for everyone to understand. Let's import our avatar into the asset panel. Move it into the scene. We can resize it using the tool at the top of the screen. Now let's import the textures. You can compress the texture so that they don't took too much space in the final file size. Next, we will find the skeleton of our 3D object in our scene and make it invisible. Then we create a new animation to make our avatar dense. We can rename our animation in the asset panel, but for the moment, we will disable the animation while we put the textures on. Now, the big job is to add the textures to all the materials that make up our avatar. So now we can put the animation back on. I'm going to add a scenery in our scene. Let's take this 3D scan of a police station. Place the 3D object as you like. Replace the avatar model and export your files to send it to your Instagram account. Once it's uploaded, you can have fun with it. Here is the final result. I hope I've taught you a little bit more about being a Naya creator. You can find some of my work on my social network. I hope to see you soon. Bye.